I'm gonna be doing the Abion and I'm gonna be doing 10 sets of 10 on the Abion. Let's get a towel from my knees here. This is a good core exercise to do. This is the Abion. Yeah, and do 10 sets of 10 on this. In between each set, we get a few second breather and then we we'll go for the next set. Yeah, this one more. That's one set. A little shake and that. Now, this is a good exercise to do. It wakes the core, you know. And it wakes the back as well, so you know. A few seconds in. A little shake on the arms. Go for a second set of 10 again. This one now. As I said, this exercise he works the he works the stomach, he works the lower back, he works your arms, he works your lats, he works your chest, he works your legs. You know, it's a good exercise to do. You know, you can invest in this. I brought this from Strength Shop. You can buy this from whatever sports shop as well. You know, when you buy this as well, you know, you can buy pads or. You could put a towel, cushion or whatever just for your knees, just to protect your knees and that. Yeah. That's second set, so we get third set. This one now. That's it. Give my arm a little shake on that, you know. So I'm gonna do 10 sets of 10 on this. Done three sets. Wait a few seconds, get a breathe again, and back on it again. So yeah, it's got the fourth set. This one. This is my second session of today. I've done, I got 100 bump burpees in today. My, it's my second session, so I've just finished my night walk, you know? So, still gotta get that money working. No excuses. The fourth set. I'm a little shake. The fifth set coming up. And we do 10 sets of 10 on this. And as I said, this is a really good exercise to do, you know, for your core. You know, I recommend those people who do sit-ups, if they do crunches or any sort of sit-ups, you know, always work the opposite muscle, work your lower back, your back as well. 
you know hyper extensions are good exercises to do but this kills like your front and your back as well so you're working both if i was just doing crunches only i'd be doing the back extensions as well you know but um also remember there's a technique when you do this ab wheel as well if you don't do it properly you mash up your lower back you know so um i'll show you the technique after a couple of sets it's the fifth set The fifth set. If you see me when I do this exercise, well, I've got five sets to go anyway. So anyway, when I do this exercise, you know, I try to put my chin onto my chest, and you know when you get that cow and cow and cat position, you got the cow and you want to go, you got the cow position. You want to stay up. You got the cow position. Okay, so look at my back here, I'm like that. So I want to be like that. You know, I'm gonna bring my, come into a cow position and put your chin on your chest, you know, tighten the core. Now if you leave your chest up, chin up like this, and you go like that, you do put a lot of pressure on your lower back. But then again, it does work for some people. If you're all right doing it, then do it. But you know, for me, if I put my chin up and I do it like this, I do put a lot of pressure on my lower back. For me, staying in this position, I'm more tight. And you know, I'm bending my arms slightly as well. You know, but sometimes with this exercise, when you do it a few times, then you just gotta do what works for you. Six, six, set. Six, six set. I've got four more sets to go, inshallah. You know, he said if it's the first time to do this, and if you do start off doing this, you know, you could just start off with like half ones, come all the way down until you can feel the stretch, and then come back up, you know, and gradually go more and more until you hit full range of motion come back in yeah so um <laughs> six or seven you know unless you want to do it prison style you could put a, you know you could get like fill up a bottle of two liter coke yeah uh, with water, sorry, and then uh, put soap, so make sure it's on like on a not not on carpet and you know on your tires or whatever. Put soap all on on one row and do it with a you know two liter bottle of coke with water in there, so you're sliding up and down, <laughs> you know. But anyway, that's prison style, anyway, but you could do this anyway. Buy one of these, I recommend those things.
seven. So we got three more. Eight. Okay, I'm just gonna, cause I'm on live on Instagram as well. So um, yeah. Eight. Uh, two more sets to go. You know, as I said, my first session I'm already done. I've done my 100 burpees, you know. So this is like my sort of like second workout, you know. I've already done my burpees. I finish off with my night walk as well. Hour and a half walk. Oh, sorry. Yeah, 10,000 step walk. And uh, yeah, so I intend to sustain in this Agriol, you know. So uh, yeah, two more sets to go to finish off 100. So, Yeah, so this is a, a nine set. One more set to make it ten sets of ten, you know. As I said, I recommend you guys get an Abriol, you know. Really good. I said this I brought from Strength Shop. You can buy it from eBay, Amazon, any or any sports shop as well, you know. Sports run. As I said, I've done the burpees anyway. You know, I've done uh, 100 burpees in one go with one pump and each, one press up on each one. It still works the core anyway, you know. This is just extra work, you know. So last set of 10. On this, as I said, I'll be, I'll be doing live streams regular now. But when I say times, I'll be just working around my time, so. You know, it's going to be kind of some funny times, but you know, I ain't got no sit times. Anyway, let's get the last set in. Sure, man. Bismillah. There you go guys, that's one hundo done, that's 10 sets, that's 10 done on this.